everybody and welcome to the uh, uh, hold on hello everybody and welcome to the discussing death battle podcast a uh, little bit of a new paint job we'll go over that later uh i am your host mo and with me as always is mac hey you one day have a different intro and mid and mid and mid did he die again? Hello. There he no. is. <laughs> you died during the reaction video. I didn't think you'd die again. Uh, and joining us as a guest this time because you know, we promised him for like two. Fucking fights. God, no! <laughs> <laughs> we promised him for two, like Bye. two fights ago, Bye. and Bye. now it's Tommy is here. Uh, so yeah, um, we've been gone a while because uh, this is a calamity. Yeah. Calamity. Do anything I said? No. We heard nothing, Med. We heard that. We heard that. You, you, we also heard, oh, fucking... Oh, my God! We heard, oh, <laughs> fucking God, no. It's just the standard connection shit. You're going to... Uh, uh, but... Like, the voice connection is going down just when we're recording. It was oh, completely God. fine until that point. At least we can hear your rage over the connection clearer. Fuck it, we're doing mic. it. Doing it good. No, we're doing it strong. Yeah, Med, Med got a new mic and all, which is why you can probably hear him a bit clearer, even though he's still cutting yeah, out. Yeah, but that's, it'll be interesting. Uh, he's still cutting out, but that's internet issues that we can't really solve. Um, so yeah, it's been a while since we've been. We, we had the reaction video up, and uh, that's because of a calamity of errors. It's quite funny if it wasn't so sad, but we're not going to go into it much. Um, my exams are over, like, so Like, this episode has been cursed. This yeah, episode... It, it's legitimately cursed. Um... Any, uh, if you guys haven't heard before we get into it, uh, we are running a poll in our Discord server. I might just put it in the description if I hadn't. It's in our Discord. It's a, can, what channel did I pin it in? Was it in general or pod, I think it was podcast talk. It's pinned on one of the channels anyway. Yeah, just join Discord and vote. Uh, rank your uh, favorite fights of the season from 1 to 16 and sometime after this episode. Yeah, probably... put, it in the, put it in the description too, why not? Yeah, I'll put it in the description too. And link it around to your friends on other servers. It's, you know, why not? And, uh, yeah. and so, yeah, how does that go again? You you rank each by... Yeah, it's... By gonna, what, it's go first I mean, I place, second place. Like, like, yes. many reasons why not, but... You, you, go, you, you rank them all. all of them. By, like, yeah, you, you, rank, you, you vote for them all, first through 16. Uh, you, and... Uh, then when it's all said and done, I'll probably close it a week after this episode airs, and uh, maybe less. Um, if it's when it's closed, I'll put up a video saying, "Hey, it's closed." Um, and then I'll make a video out of it where all the viewers' votes will be in one category, and then me, Mac, and Med's votes will be in another, and like the average of the four is where they all lie, kind of thing. I probably explained that badly, but you'll see it in the video. It's fine. Uh, but we have to get going because we have a lot to cover. Like way more than humanly possible but we're gonna do it because why not um fortunately most of these uh like a lot of the stuff we have to cover isn't like that bad like it's pretty easy to figure out uh pretty easy to cover but yeah like the, the, we start the we start this at promise this episode when there was three episodes to cover in season four now we're already on the start, first episode of season five to cover as well oh boy um. Right. So the first battle, are you all ready to go? Yep. It's fine. Yep. Uh. So we have a shonen jump battle. Naruto versus. Naruto versus Yu Gi Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yes, we're good. It's a good. It's a good episode. My favorite. Yeah. It's a. Uh... For the fourth time now. The fourth since time. Since we've been trying to do this, it... it is a really good episode. It's one of the best. Death Bell has ever produced at least like top five or so, arguably. It was so Although good it cursed our podcast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Med, that's not yeah. wrong. Um, so good, it cursed us. Yeah, you fucking devil god magic <clears throat> cursed us. Um, yeah, it's so it's pro out of the top right, five but... episodes ever. It's probably the only 2D one that would make the list. Not even just saying, oh, that's the knock on 2D. It's just 3D ones tend to be these bigger scale, more effort put into them affairs. But this one, this one is solidly in that top five, top ten. Um, it's yeah, it's it, excellent. Like, oh wait, do we talk? Do we like go over like the the 
Fight first. Yeah, might not. Or uh, animation's good, yeah. Alright, so, like. Ichigo, the most respect given out of... Like, I... It's hard, it's, like... He got some more respect than any loser, and probably, like, most of the winners of the A show. A lot of winners, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Fucking, <coughs> like, Zex from... Oh, yeah, Zex got Sword versus... shit on. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and... Ichigo just came out looking like a fucking boss, you know? He, he came out almost looking better, not quite better than Naruto, although he definitely had the hyper scenes. Uh, but, yeah, he came out looking really good out of this. You know, when you hear Ben and Chad and all of them talking on their podcast about how they don't go in wanting to bash a character, and then you see the final product, and you're like, yeah, you clearly didn't intend to, but you did. Uh, this this is the one of the few times, if not the only time, I can say... Yeah, you without shadow of a doubt gave both characters their due and them some. It was really, really good. Um, and as no, you... I think Ichigo had better, had, had more cooler shit than Naruto did. Yeah, as he... far as like lines. Yeah, and, he and did. I, I, that, yeah, he did. I said that, but like. And like at the yeah. same time, though. Now, at the same time, Naruto wasn't like didn't come off as a chump. He was like leading most of most, if not. Yeah, the fight. Yeah, it was the fight. Animation. Like an actor, yeah. Like the advantage. Yeah, all throughout the fight, Naruto never really seemed on the back foot for more than a second. Uh, like he seemed to be kind of control- fight. <laughs> yeah, he he seemed he was kind of egging Ichigo on the whole time. Just uh, every time Ichigo had to go a step or two up to compete with whatever Naruto pulled out, Naruto just went the next step up and just yeah, <laughs> 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 yeah. It was a. In that, in that regard. Yeah, me, oh man, Rasengan. The means goes like, what? That's bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> I finally get to stab a guy and he's not dead. <laughs> yeah, it's just like, wait, I stabbed the guy. Now there's more of that guy all around me with glowing spears of death. Uh, he... uh, I, I do kind of wish that they had gotten the classic bleach move of teleport, of nothing personal kid. On <laughs> <laughs> my level. <laughs> oh my, oh and then Naruto no sells it. <laughs> um, but can we Johnny Young Bosch? Yeah, Frogman as as he was linked. Johnny Young Bosch. Yeah, they they got Ichigo's That's actual Mac. voice actor. That's the coolest thing possibly this show has ever done. Mac is Max freaking out over there. Uh, oh, sorry, my shit is going on. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's I was fine. trying to collect all my uh dry cleaning <laughs> okay um anyway yeah, yeah, yeah. johnny on bosch was fucking amazing yeah i don't know if anybody said that yet <laughs> yeah we just said we're literally just on that so you slot right back in there buddy um hey. yeah um how the fuck they got how the fuck they managed to to work through the linguistics talking about the fight i don't know those uh, connections uh, honestly just... honestly uh i'd say when they uh, he approached them rather than the other way around i'd say they didn't even try Maybe yeah. what a send off for him doing that character too. Like, yeah, it's not an official like, fucking fizz or anything, but like, holy shit, dude! Like, yeah, this, this is this is pretty much it for his Ichigo, and like, he, he gave it his all. He, it's he's one. Wait, uh, wait, you can tell when voice actors get attached. You can tell when voice actors get attached to a role, and I think he has, and he wants this so badly. Yeah. yeah. So um, yeah, it was. Uh, the whole fight as a whole, as you've said many times at this point, uh, it was here. Beautiful. It was Pick good. up the stick, Ichigo. Pick up the fucking stick. <laughs> the fucking, uh, the new get- I love the fight. Best death. He had the close-ups in this fight are possibly the best that they've ever done. Uh, no, Sorry, they, the are, they are the stuff, best, yeah, they are the best, yeah. Um, the, uh, some- uh, the music's pro- one of the best. I mean, it's not, like, power level, but... Yeah, it's, it was pretty good. It was pretty good music. Yeah, like, it's really good. It's of the yeah, it's episodes that we're going to talk about. It's my second favorite of the tree, but that's because the other one that is my favorite is just so fucking good. Um, but this one is also amazing. It's a kind of I have a Spotify playlist it, of all. Uh, yeah, the, this, and this is my favorite. But this is like, but that's kind of. Or I guess that would be kind of due to bias. Like, mm. this was my childhood fight. Yeah, yeah, as you said, uh, this was yeah, this was a good episode. Uh, the anime, yeah, I can't complain much about the anime. Okay, yeah. just uh, and the research. Why, uh, 
Me Ichigo, but they admitted that they were doing that, so nobody cares. And good. Can yeah, they were giving him a benefit of the doubt. Yeah, they, they, they yeah. blew everything about Ichigo out of proportion. My point! In analysis! <laughs> yeah, okay, uh... Ichigo was exaggerated, but they admitted it was exaggerated. I would like very much for this to be done in future fight. If it was not, then we'll talk about that later. Uh, <laughs> uh, the black God. boxes. Even uh, his cosplays have to be uh, so Naruto, underhanded. Yeah, kind of exactly. At least it's based on like a thing that exists. Yeah, the, uh, the speed statement. His, yeah. uh, his uh, attack potency durability got slightly uh, down to it, but not as, nearly as much as it, it's good now. It's, it's good. Yeah. You, you, you don't need the good. They, they, like... they got it nearly right. I think Ichigo's stats, if I'm not mistaken, are higher than he's been given in anything ever. Even in like his most out there versus stats, except maybe... No, Scandi. there's some, like, planet yeah, stuff, there's Scandi, I guess. Like, yeah, there's Scandi. Scandi Ewok is higher, but, like, oh, yeah. in terms of, oh, without doing that... for, like, abilities and stuff, it was really good. Yeah. Pretty I mean, much everything about the, they, the analysis. They got it felt like a season finale, but they it wasn't got a tiny bits wrong. I don't know if Mugetsu is actually an attack, but they gave it to him anyway, because Ichigo needs all that crap and they were just putting yeah, it up they covered it in the DVD. And, it, uh, and it just looks good. it just looks cool too yeah they just they try to get everything they could uh, as for naruto i'm pretty sure he still has the tiny bit of chakra from all the tailed beasts in him so like they said he didn't in the in the box it doesn't matter it's just like yeah. semantics yeah whatever um yeah, yeah no he still he still has it it's like kurama was split into no it's a uh, he has like Little bit of chakra from all nine. He just has all of Kurama as well. That's yeah, because you know, just give him more powers. In all fairness, Sasuke has like every other power that you could possibly need. So you kind of need to balance those two out. Um. Also, they shot on Boruto and it was good. Yeah, Bar <laughs> <laughs> shooting on Boruto is pretty amazing. Oh, and I actually laughed at one of their jokes. They, their jokes were pretty on point in this episode. Not the best that they've ever yeah. been, but they were, yeah, they were novel. Yeah, but like I actually laughed at for the last time I've done that in this show. Mm. Which joke was it again? Uh, the little boys. Like it's it's so immature, but oh, it's like yeah. the delivery. <laughs> yeah, the delivery of it. Was good. Yeah, that was a good one. Uh, all right. Uh, I we would right. honestly if you're if you guys are upset we didn't talk about this more we've talked about this four times at this point I'm sorry we've we we talked about this for half an hour once and yeah no no I'm good every, I'm good I said everything crashed. I needed to say. No, I'm more talking to yeah, the really. audience so yeah we we, we kind of the only through. other thing only other thing I'll add is that the black boxes are like the best thing they've ever added yeah I I agree long time. I said as much yeah. to Ben personally on Twitter that it's the best thing that they've ever added to the show since they got rid of the fucking health bars it's that good <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. And they've, they've been good in keeping those. I think they've yeah, been in every episode since. It's so it's gods here. Yeah, e even if it's it helps. Not even if they have misinformation, it helps get where they're coming from. You know, get where they're coming from. Yeah, that's yeah, really all three. Important. Um, it's because a lot of times when they say things that are just what, it's it, it's about context. You're like, where did they even get that idea from? Now we know where they get that idea from. It still reduces the what reaction, but now at least we know. At least we get it. You know, at least we get their reasoning. It's just sometimes it can be bad reasoning. Yeah, really like for example, the next fight. <laughs> I saw that coming a mile. Away. Yeah, that segue. Yeah. Okay. Uh, first things first. Yeah. The end. You rather lackluster. Yeah, the animation. It was. It was good animation. It was just too short. It was. <sighs> it's Batman Beyond versus Spider Man 2099. Yeah. We, right, we right. haven't. We haven't seen it. Was said all right. It was. It was okay. Yeah. Super meh, and it has to live up to fucking the, one of the best episodes of season one, and I think it failed that, like, massively. Like, the... Like, the, it came right after the episode that proves, that, or that should have proved, that 2D can be just as good as 3D. And then, and then it comes... Yeah. Um... Ah, oh, Marilyn Monroe. So... Yeah, this was a... This was a... Ah, uh, Bruce's neck. <laughs> the more, the more I think about, it, the more I thought about this episode after watching it initially. And I've seen it a couple times since, obviously, because I have to. It's just, it's just for this. Um, yeah, I like, I dislike it more and more. It's a pretty bad episode. And uh, we've had worse this season. Don't get me wrong, but uh, and and overall, yeah. but it's just kind. Of, it's 
feels fillery, and that's not something you should waste someone like Zack on. And the f they have so much more to do, and the kill shot was super lame, and like I appreciate the callback. I like the kill shot. It was it was just kind of explosive batteries gets a little bit old after a while because it feels like that Batman was... characters kind of go with that. Like in most verses, like they both have so much. More. I expected them to be fucking tearing. Shows or whatever. I expected them to be tearing each other apart with claws. They both have claws. What the fuck are you doing? Having them throw punches at each other into buildings, and then slapping explosive batarangs on each other. Batarangs that shouldn't, like even by their own analysis, yeah, like it shouldn't have killed. The CQC was. It. was so it's short. a much. It was a much better. Beast versus Goliath. Yeah, it basically feels like that, but much, much more polished. It's a, sim it's a similar environment, similar setup. Similar ki Oh god, it is. I, it's Beast yes? vs. Man, I wouldn't say why? This episode is as it's not as bad, obviously. What happened? You, you, no. Yeah, but you've just put that comparison in my brain, and I'm like, oh my god, that's actually really it, accurate. It, it is re Yeah, I mean, it is very similar. I wouldn't like, as bad as no. far as, like, it'd be... It's not as pointless. There was clearly effort put in, one... and the soundtrack really helps with giving it a little bit of empathy. Like, you know... But uh, it also feels like Miguel was sacrificed okay. to get Terry in. So. <clears throat> this episode wasn't as pointless as that one, I would say, either, because that one just kind of exists to get Goliath in there because they really wanted Goliath to show up. Whereas this one actually... Yeah, it was well, requested. People yeah. wanted to see this one. Mm. It's just yeah. another fucking Batman versus Spider-Man rivalry, quote-unquote, match, which... I can't I wait think for Joker versus Green Goblin. <laughs> I yeah. just can't <laughs> wait. That's uh, gonna be, especially when, no more Batman. Especially when Joe. <laughs> fuck Tommy, I was good. You fucking ah, uh, that joke's much better than what I was going for. Ah, uh, yeah. I missed that joke. Thanks. There's no more Batman. That's a good thing. <laughs> yeah, no more. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, this episode. And as for the verdict, uh, um, it's wrong. It's wrong. And I'll, uh, Tommy, how wrong is it? Terry and Amy, my sweet it, it, boy. It, it, it's a bit wrong. <laughs> it's a yeah. bit wrong. Uh, first, let's talk about like. Alright, uh, first, let's let me uh, nitpick a bit. Uh, they mentioned electrocution, like shutting down Lila, and I, I, I just think Nick even let. He was electrocuted multiple times, one of them by Electro, and that did not shut down Lila, so I have no idea where they're getting that from. Uh. Because uh, that because they can't hack the Batcave, therefore they cannot hack the suit. Which I, the suit's been hacked before; it's totally Google, and it's yeah. There's and it's an episode that, based around that, right? Yeah, the Batcave. Yeah, yeah they have they might have a point. Uh, also, but not, I'm not the suit at all. I'm pretty sure that's not the DCU Batcave that held off ba uh, brain or DCAU that held off. Brain oh no, it's all comic book. I, yeah, yeah. They, they wrap all... for some reason. They wrapped up the comic. Now I know Terry's in the comic now but it's a different version of terry and i know they composite shit but that's a weird thing to composite it's a weird like it's 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 strange and it's not it's like explicitly not a thing in the show like king so yeah, yeah. Um, I, I, um uh do you have more for us tommy like yeah yeah i have more uh another nitpick i I'm like reasonably certain that then when they calculated it for the the howitzer or whatever it was, that they uh, used like FMA, but like for acceleration they used speed instead. I like, remember you oh, yeah, talking yeah, yeah, about yeah. this. You're like, how do you fuck up force mass acceleration? Yeah, it sounds like they did. I remember. I'm like reasonably certain. Yeah. You uh, yeah. Another thing, the yeah. uh, the fucking uh, bowler cow uh, that they did for uh, Terry. Fucking yeah, that's buoyancy. Uh, I do like that they included the buoyancy thing, like props there, but like, just, no. Uh, firstly, the way they show it on screen, they got it completely like mixed up, like the number where the number for buoyancy is, they put where the density is or something like that. They completely, uh, like, traded it for some reason. The end was what they were trying to calculate, so it doesn't, so that's not important. Uh, the the thing that really fucks it up is that they modeled it as like a perfect sphere when it in fact a sphere it's actually like sort of like a like you, you can see what it is but yeah uh, and that and normally I wouldn't be like too mad about it because it doesn't affect but when it's this close and uh, yeah properly calculated it, it drops it down to like I think it was uh, 74 tons or something like that less than what they give Miguel 
Yeah. <coughs> and as for what they gave Miguel, it just seems really downplayed. <laughs> yeah, so... Uh, and also... Yeah, let's really get into it. The, yeah, the, hold, just one Fucking, thing One thing uh, before before Tommy starts. The, this idea they have of let's not scale Miguel. To, we, they did it in the end. Like, let's give him the benefit of the doubt, like Ichigo. But let's not scale Miguel to a guy he's fought and beaten and beaten stronger guys than constantly. Let's not scale this feats to him at all because their powers come from different places. What is that bullshit? You can kind of tell the difference like, between the Nick episode and the Sam episode because that's the, that's the kind of shit that led to Goku not being scaled to other characters from Dragon Ball in Goku for Superman, which would have made it a whole lot easier and would have not gravity formed this shit. And they probably still would have came out to the result they got because of how they scaled those other characters. Whereas this kind of bullshit was, uh, yeah, the, the, the previous bullshit was like direct scaling. This guy did this. Ichigo is as strong and as fast as him. So I, we'll, we'll get into, uh, in the next fight, we'll get right into how DB has a tank. Oh, based on yeah, things that's right at the moment. <laughs> Well, yeah, that's a baseball. Anyway, uh, <laughs> that, that's a that one's gonna. Oh, be... we're gonna have no, we're gonna have fun with the next. <laughs> we're gonna have nuts. Uh, okay, nuts, so basically, uh, things that they did not include for Miguel, uh, his feat of catching uh, Mjolnir, which was coming at him at like zero point C, which is being speed of light, so it came out like Mach two thousand. Mm. Uh, did not include that. Or several of his other feats, like uh, tanking the beam that would give it a normal person, which got like building level. Speaking of which, don't you just love it when DB gives both characters a fucking wall level feat because of the lift thing? <laughs> and their thing is the end all be all of I can't calculate anything else. Uh, yeah, I guess. That's One. the worst. But the, it's. The, the... Uh, we all strong and then they. But yeah. Uh. Also, and, c it, is it just me, or is the feet of Miguel of, of Terry lifting that boulder? Is it kind of doesn't line up with anything else he's done in the series? Where he struggled with lifting other things that are much lighter, you know? Yeah, so, but like with their uh, normal, the, with their doesn't really matter. Yeah, with because, the, because it's so much, it's so even like him breaking walls and stuff would be like way higher. And yeah, I, I know, I know, but I'm just talking about from their logical standpoint that they they were all willing to discount. XYZ feet because they it's not it's uh, above what Spider-Man's capable that is uh, like you know when they were doing that shit and like yeah but that was spy all those feats for Spider-Man oh, early in his career but then this one was perfectly mm, fine baby. yeah this one was perfectly fine because Terry did it and even though it's like way above anything else he's done uh, it's fucking double standards go, yeah, go on Tommy I don't mind that too much what I do mind is fucking 100 done Spidey Despite him holding up a skyscraper on two separate occasions, as well as a bunch of other people. Yeah. That's... Because when he was fucking starting yeah, out, he was there's no way. And I hate saying that because I like Terry more. But yeah. He's... Yeah. 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 That, that's fine. I, I like them both about yeah, equally, but they don't really have much of an attachment to either. But like, I, I, I remember waking up and watching Batman Beyond a lot as a kid. And it's like this is except it was called Batman in the Future here. So when I went to look for it when I was first there, first on the internet, I was like, oh, I can't find anything for it. But there is this cool series called Batman Be. Oh, it's the same. You know that that kind of. Uh, I think that was my first yeah. introduction to different names across the, like the states. It was called what there? Batman in the Future or Batman of the Future or something like that. Batman of yeah, the yeah. Future. Yeah, it's I mean, it's a lot worse. The name. country's weird. It's a more on the nose. Uh, it's <laughs> like any anyone who can like shit talk the Joker into like a mental break down instant respect. Yeah, but yeah, it, it's 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 a fight. Yeah, it, it happened. It's a fight. It they got it wrong, but that doesn't really matter. It's what really matters is it was just meh overall. Like our neck? No, wait, no, never mind. No, <laughs> you, you you ruined that one. You're completely off the mark there. <laughs> like, yeah. You, like you 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 aim for China and hit the moon. Uh, so. Uh, well, I still hit the moon. <laughs> um, yeah. So that's. I see you. <laughs> to the moon, though. Yeah. So uh, let's leave that train wreck for a second or forever, and. Uh, and go to the moon. Go to the moon or the sun. Uh. Supernova. Sephiroth versus Virgil. The season finale is season four. Oh my! I I don't think we need to hide how much me, Mac, and Tommy love this episode. 
because of our live reaction. Go watch that. Uh, but no one has also, known Med. Yeah, what do you think of it, Med? Is Mike is Mike coming to Med? Me again? No, no, Mike no, no give, give him give him a sec. Give him a sec. Let's talk to talk to fill the airtime. He's probably really angry right now. Or he can't hear what we're saying. That's also possible. <laughs> what? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> right, man, give us your uh, opinion before wow, internet dies again. Not to pick up. Yeah. It was really good. Probably my second favorite of the season. First off, all the memes going about, yeah, Death Battle's going to fuck this up. Yeah, there's no, there's no chance. Let's just forget about... Oh, I said on. Let's just... <laughs> For Sephiroth actually fucking won, and in a beautiful animation. Yes, yeah, I, I think yeah. I think it's between, it's, really good. it's between this uh, and Megazord vs Voltron, the best fight that Torian's done this season. Yeah, and it's just God. They're so like I a part of that a weird part that I really liked was the flash stepping. Yeah, they actually got that right this time. It was it looked really good. Um, Am I still here? Yeah, you're yeah. still here. I'm still yeah. fucking here. Voices connected is in green. Green means go. <laughs> <laughs> He's so mad. Uh, okay. Uh, Cat eyes. Cat eyes are good, I guess. Uh, <laughs> Black sword. That was good. Virgil was thick. That was good. <laughs> Enjoy <laughs> thick. <laughs> One thick boy. <laughs> uh, Matt, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's just. Uh, uh, yes. Finally. It was a good episode. Uh, so you are. Yeah, that was the, it. Was a good. And then he cuts him in half. Yeah, you fucking. Uh, was it? Is it Crisis Core Fat or thing. is it a uh, fucking? What's it called? Advent Children. Daddy, it's having children. Having children. Okay, I'm not too big into Final Fantasy as I think I've mentioned before. I think it was back when I was guesting. Damn. Yeah, but I looked into Kingdom Hearts Master Race. Yo, fuck the Sephiroth no. bosses. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> First one was better than the second one. Yes, uh, but the game or the or the boss. The boss. Okay, yeah, fine, that's fair. I remember doing it before I beat the game. I like before I had all the good shit. I didn't get the ultimate weapon or anything, I just went in and beat Sephiroth when my friend couldn't. And he had been playing King of Hearts for 10 years, and it was like my first time true. And I, <laughs> I beat some other super bosses, and then some of the ones that he had beat, I couldn't. It was really weird. I never actually finished King of Hearts 1, because I wanted to get the ultimate weapon first, got bored of grinding, and gave it back to him. Uh, but anyway, uh, yeah. Um, Do it, you fool. I have to get, then I have to get back to him, and, and I have to get my PS3 working. If I get the connection myself on PS4, I'll do it. Anyway. Yeah. Just get the ultimate collection. Yeah, I know, yeah. but I'm poor. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Should be cheap now. I know, but I have, like, you see, I, you know how much money I have? That much. None. Zero. Nada. Uh, so, uh, yeah, this fight, let's get out of my depression for a second. It was good shit. There was, we've gone over the animation before. Uh, Tommy, <laughs> do you have anything to add on the verdict? I think you... We, we all know about your uh, your reactions to it that were pretty great during the, uh, <laughs> the live reaction. I, uh, uh, I, I really like how the animation like translated uh, Virgil's DMC4 gameplay really well. <laughs> like it, it, like it feels like a humble video. You know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I gotcha. Yeah, yeah. That fucking that Chun that Chun Li super. Yeah. That one, all he, he can was, actually. Like, that's actually part of his combo set, though, like in the games. Yeah, yeah, I, I've I've heard about yeah, that. E but every, everything that they did came from the games, which is pretty cool. Um, but it's like it's like you can also like their joke about Virgil being a Street Fighter fan. Like I don't know, it kind of made it a little bit better. Yeah, for me. it's pretty good. Pretty which good. is also kind of endearing to me. I don't know, like Virgil going to evil evil. <laughs> he, he he walks he walks out of a fucking portal from between dimensions just like with blood on the sword. It's like I got here in time for the Justin Wong and F Champ fight. Uh, so, yeah. Strangely enough, he would be the weirdest looking guy there. <laughs> so, this is the power of humanity. <laughs> Give me a fight stick, one with the dick in place the the stick in place of a dick. Uh, so um, yeah. Um, do you have anything to say on the verdict, anyway, Tommy? Like, the actual match? Uh, on the verdict itself, no. 
I'm aware that the stuff not really besides the besides it being fucking obvious and shit. <laughs> on the analysis, on the other hand, I have a lot to say. Oh yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> yeah. Uh, fuck me. Where do I even start? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, start okay, okay, start, okay, with, uh, start with start uh, with a Beowulf. No, wait, Beowulf okay. is the fav my favorite. Oh, the Beowulf calc. Okay, yeah. that that'll. Okay, uh, first of all, they just straight up just used the mass of an elephant <laughs> rather than calculated it, which is you know what I'm saying. Yeah. That's uh, bad. Now now let's get to the real problem here. Uh, fucking slow motion scaling for a scene that isn't even fucking slow motion. <laughs> And also, isn't it's I, so bad? I, I, they talk I, about did we talk about the scaling yet? Because that's also like one of the. We'll no, get no, there. No. We'll get there. Uh, you know, I wouldn't be so mad at the fucking slow if that at least said like we're seriously overestimating him and then decaf or something like that. But no, instead we got fucking FF7. It's hard to cover memes. They they said that he's stronger. My Dark favorite memes. Save your feet. Save your feet. Um, so yeah, that was that hard. That's... We're so dead at that time! Exactly! Uh, also, oh, yeah. They, yeah, yeah, let's talk about scaling to Dante. Virgil is kind of father. Uh, also... He's actually kind of father. Also, uh, oh, one, one, one thing, the scene, the raindrop scene. I've heard people complain about it, it's like, what's what's the matter with the feet? It's like, uh... Their maths, what's the matter with raindrops? Yeah, their, their math's probably off, and it's nowhere near as impressive as they make it out to be, but it still seems like a legitimate feat. Uh, I was looking into it, it never actually happened. It's non-canon. Oh yeah, uh, yeah it's, it's, it, it only it's, happens in the opening. Honestly, I'd, I'd use it anyway. But, uh, uh, here's, but we also see that confrontation later in the game, where the raindrops aren't even yeah, there. To be honest, it could it could be like representing something that what happens in the gameplay fight because it skips around. Like they compose it anyway, so that I don't really give a shit about. Mm, I just it's uh, it's it's funny to me. That's all. But I do give a shit about. Or, yeah, it's, it is kind of. Funny. Uh, ha But yeah, as I, I was saying before, uh, Bertel is actually kind of fodder in the DMC. Like, he, he might be under Nero's level, unironically. <laughs> because, <laughs> so I, so yeah, I, I, I heard that against, against... If he, if he was like, to come back to life, he wouldn't be fodder. He'd probably get the scaling to the good shit then, but he hasn't yet. We have to wait for DMC 5 for that. Don't shut up, Munch. He blew up, though! He blew up! You act like that's gonna yeah. keep a fictional character dead, man. Think for a second. Fair enough, birds. <laughs> yeah, as I was saying, like out. him plus Dante was what it needed, what was needed to beat someone with the net. And then he got set for Sedge and lost to Dante. Meanwhile, Nero against an awakened for Sedge actually wins. So yeah, level that was, and that, like I, that's, that's just that, funny. I, I anyway. enjoy that. Yeah. <clears throat> Okay, uh, what else, what else? Oh yeah, uh, tons of issues with Thunder Force when they said the, uh, 30 fucking Hiroshima bombs or whatever. Oh, that, yeah. The fucking getting, uh, Newtons and tons of force and shit. Me, oh my god. It's so funny. Yeah, uh, nuke level doors, my dudes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You, you know what's even worse? Like, some like, defending it. Like I've seen, I've seen people like legit be like, "Nah, you're just done overestimating nukes, my nu nukes are actually sub door level." It's in all like, fairness, they said that it's a uh, okay. It Underestimating nukes is something I never thought I would hear. Yeah, I know that's weird, but uh, uh, in all fairness to the calc, they didn't say the doors are like equal to the nuke. They said it was a force. Of a... Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. they the, said the they said that happens. Sephiroth strikes yeah. are equal to the nuke. Not Zach's, because remember they calculated Sephiroth to be no, no. five times stronger. It's not that I'm big just... a deal. It's still in the ballpark, and that still makes it fucking insanity. But it's just you know, you know, to be perfect. Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, actually, the like the, the force itself, like I, I, I they didn't even show math for that. But no, the only problem is literally them thinking that the uh, kiloton measurement for the bomb is in force rather than because it's actually an energy. Yes. Uh, please yeah. use dual death battle. Just switch to duels. No, you like, fucking. Yes, please. Duels, yeah, duels yeah. is fine and all, but just stick to kilotons and actually know what they are, please. Well, yeah, duels and then yeah, tons of TNT, I know what tons but, uh, are. Ton tons is one thing. Just stick to fucking tons of TNT. Like tons is different. Yeah. You know, it, it, it's so yeah. different. Blow things up, okay? Um, yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, what else? What else? Uh, they didn't. Virgil never uh, said he was I, garbage. I, 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 uh, <laughs> um, what did he say? 
Another thing I just like never is, said he was motivated. <laughs> that means you motivated to complain about the fact you didn't say he was motivated, man. Uh, you were saying, Tommy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, another thing uh, I gotta complain about real quick. They didn't mention like pale horse or anything, so we didn't get this what little sad small frog. Mm. That would have been hilarious. Yeah, I mean they they just kind of like kind of like just wiped away like mo of Sephiroth's arsenal, they gave him like some magic, but it's like, where, where the fuck the material at, man? <laughs> they don't... I mean, him. Torian's yeah. not good with magic. <laughs> yeah. not even... Still, I mean, it's just it's just a little cloud, and then poof, he's a frog. Like, <laughs> that, that's easy. Um, I think my favorite uh. part of the whole thing, other than, Be other than the Beowulf thing, that's fucking hilarious, is uh, Supernova and all the shit that comes with it. Oh yeah. Yeah, my reaction like, to that like, was uh, it, it's it's they They actually did a lot that oh, I put yeah. in credit. Yeah for. they did, but they also but really they also fucked did. it up. Like they, yeah. what they said about Supernova isn't that bad. But then they went out of their way to try and justify Sephiroth tanking it with oh he's actually an illusion. Which okay, fine if you're gonna be consistent about it. But then they said that the party tanked it, so which means Part, okay, let's, let's do the equation real quick in our head. Link and Cloud. I don't want to. No, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Shut oh up. my Look, god. Every Final Fantasy yeah. Yeah. Link and Cloud. Link and, That's what you need to know. Link, is Link and Yang, greater than Final Fantasy VII Party. Uh, oh, that... Because they, they beat Tifa and Cloud, and Cloud's also greater than Sephiroth, like canonically, who are all greater than Virgil, and the Final Fantasy VII Party is all stronger than Sephiroth by this logic. Like much stronger. Also, that means we have like solar system level Yang because you know she beat someone. Uh, who... <laughs> because of pillars. <laughs> because uh, pillars are much stronger than supernovas. You know. Well, maybe it took like a megaton to break that pillar. You know. Yeah. Oh yeah. god, the whole it's, fucking it's a super pillar. How, how can the sun compare to a whole megaton? You know, it's that that kind so of. And it's a megaton of force too. <laughs> punch the sun, fuck's sake. If you if you punch the sun. And with a megaton of force, the sun is gonna be hit with a megaton of force. That's a lot of tons, yo. Uh, <laughs> Mega in the name. <laughs> you ever see Digimon, bro? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so could a billion lions equal a me megaton? Because I think. Yeah, oh, here we go. This is the real question. This is what the podcast is all about. Um, We're getting into that real shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. It's a lot of lions. If you couldn't tell by our obvious sarcasm for a lot, this, this is a similar sort of thing to uh, Zero versus. Uh, Mount Sonic in that it really throws a lot of previous verdicts into question uh, like from their own internal logic um, maybe they can stop better Link, Honestly, Link, Link uh, versus I Cloud is them the contradicting themselves with them just fucking up again yes this is true I agree but Link versus Cloud in particular is like okay how do you like because the feat that they yeah to be fair that was season one so yeah the feat they gave Link is like way lower than what they gave Sephiroth and Cloud is like canonically better than Sephiroth in like every way um, so yeah. Um, yeah, it's like, I think I... Maybe it's like them admitting they were wrong without actually saying it, because they're never going to say it, and honestly, well, ben, they can't. Uh, ben did say on Twitter that he's a lot of things in Goku vs. Superman 1 and Goku vs. Superman 2 he thinks is wrong. Uh, he, yeah. he, says, he still thinks yeah. it's right, though. Yeah, That's he still thinks thing. it's right. <laughs> Although... Yeah, I don't think he'll ever revert. <laughs> No, you won't. I mean, that's fine. That's that's fair. Yeah, like yeah. we can't blame them for that because the, if they reverse one verdict, then everyone's going to be like every verdict. Yeah, and also I saw. Yeah, give him an inch. In all fairness, I just saw the GT feed for the first time myself. I'm like, how did that get as high as it did? So I don't know. I think that might need to be looked at again. Um, but the super stuff is obviously, you know. I don't know, there was a galaxy in the background, so I, I mean, it depends I on how close he was to the... I don't, but it's, 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 I don't know, it kind of looks like Luminosity. It's just weird! It's weird. Yeah, let's not get fat. Let's, yeah, let's yeah, not get fat. Yeah, okay. We, kinda, uh, we, kinda, we kinda, only kinda, have, like... We, we've done about 40 minutes. minutes. Or, we've done about 40 minutes from my... Uh, minutes? Yeah. yeah. That could be spent on melees. Yeah. Yeah, we... Alright, uh... Oh god, that was uh, the best segment. One more thing. Okay, that was pretty like good. Good like job. Okay, hands. Tommy has one more thing to add. Oh. oh yeah. Things... I like how they covered the uh, mind hacks and the whole cutting dimension stuff. I like how they did that. I think... Uh, isn't, isn't the actual going through dimensions with Yamato only in, uh... 
the... Yeah, it's only in the... Uh, we did. Yeah. Because he got fucking stuck in hell, so how the fuck... And he needed to do, like, a bunch of ritual stuff to get into it. And he never actually cuts through the mentions at any point in time, so... Yeah. Just kind of kind of... Unless it's, like, tied to a machine or whatever. So, I, like, have, so I have movie. bad memories of debating Amato and its dimensional hacks. So, the scene... <laughs> yeah, you, you know exactly what I'm talking about, Mac. You were there. So, uh, or were you? Yeah, you were. We were arguing for its favor, though, back then, even though no, we knew it was you were. a little bit I BS. wasn't. <laughs> I, I was 100% against oh, is it. it. All right. Oh, uh, yeah, he, yeah, you were with Xenos on that no, one, Zen I think. No, Xenos was the also, one arguing uh, for it. He was was yeah. he? I thought he was no, he Team was, Bayo. No, he, he was, but he also said that Dante had a <laughs> chance because he could, like, use dimensional hacks. And, like, that doesn't seem like it. I, I think someone else brought up the rocket launcher, and I just kept bringing it up. And Dante's sword, Ooh. and he was, was like, he was. and he was like, oh, but they have dimensional hex resistant. What? It's a fucking <laughs> rocket launcher. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, I, was, I don't. I have a feeling he wouldn't decide that way now. It's, it's maybe. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, no. Oh yeah, a lot uh, of that one last thing. Yeah, I really want to see Dante uh, win. <laughs> <laughs> that too. Yeah. One last thing, Tommy. Uh oh, and one last thing. So they. They like during their supernova explanation. They they like admit that summons are canon and the thing that happens and stuff. And they allow killing to fucking Zack, right? And he canonically fought by him with Fury. So uh, why the fuck did they not did they kill him to uh, busting open the door, but not say uh, <laughs> destroying a fucking continent? <laughs> <laughs> I guess they don't know a bit. <laughs> they, or how, care. Did, they they must yeah they must have missed Bahama Fury. They mo I don't know how, because it's like one of the main, if not the main, feats for the verse. Because dude was flying from the moon to the earth, like it's it, like it's such a big. The flag. team was flying from the moon to the earth. Bahamut was flying from another planet to Earth. Yeah, but he has like in the millions of times FTL, I think. Yeah, it's a, yeah. it's such a blatant feat, and it's the main. Demi is it, faster than light. It is the main. <laughs> it's the main feat in the verse because oh, and it they goes checked to everybody. Media. What? Uh, and they checked Ultimania, so they should know that Typhoon flips. <laughs> and they just like, eh. or they should. I mean, it they depends should on what research but... was give team was giving them. So I don't know if somebody missed that or. Uh, uh oh. Yeah, cutscene feet. Sephiroth has the uh, tanking, the awakening of the weapons, which got like fucking country level, like terratons and shit. Oh yeah, I remember oh, that. And... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wasn't Cloud a ground zero? Story, they... Cutscene feet. Yeah, yeah, he was. Yeah, that no, was the rest like of the party wasn't, wild. but just just Cloud and Zephyr. That was like this one. And Eret's corpse. corpse. This is why Tommy's here. Um, so yeah. That, yeah. We, they did good enough to get him the win. Yeah, like, it's fun. Yeah. Like, they still got it right, and the episode was entertaining regardless. It's just looking back and like, if you compare this to the, you know, it's kind of a... Uh... Also, Link they're them saying, them saying the fucking, uh, what's it called? Healing factor can be overtaxed. Where was that for Bayonetta? <laughs> Where the fuck that come from? Where? Like, <laughs> uh, and always could only be more awkward if Bayonetta had the ability to magically summon guillotines to chop someone's head off and keep them separate. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do you think like maybe they started to like not wank healing factors as much after like Hulk versus Doomsday? Yeah. I, I think that may... yeah that fight might have turned them yeah. around. Although, which is ironic because it's they... the one healing factor that pretty much operates the exact way they says it, they say it does. <laughs> yeah, like they don't even get cut in half. Um, quickly. They do, but they don't like fucking fall apart. Yeah, it's because the healing factor heals them fast enough. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, so uh one minute melee. One minute melee. We'll be uh, we'll be back to Sephiroth versus Virgil in about three melees. Uh so we have first of all Bill Cipher versus Sans. Yeah. Uh, Better than it has any right to be. Yeah, that's that's, that's the it really was. That's the, be. Yeah, that's the Love best. It. Yeah, it's it's a pretty decent animation for a pretty what the it, fuck fight. You know? Yeah. Like it, it was in character. It was fun to watch, I guess. One sided, but of course it was going to be one sided. Any fight with Sans has to be one sided, because everybody insists on keeping to his gimmick. Oh. That Sans is like this like omnipotent deity, like like he, omnipotent. He's cool as a game and stuff, but I mean he's not like he his his best thing, like like the fourth wall and shit. It, it's bullshit, weird shit. But he's shit. not a god because of that's it. not even 
But I more mean I more mean that in like yeah. he, he only he dies to one hit no matter what is what I'm more I'm getting at because yeah that that too. That, that really limits people in animation when he they hold to it you know yeah really I just like the fight for Bill yeah that's fair Bill's pretty cool though Sans did most of the heavy lifting to make the fight look good in all fairness yeah enough. but Bill Bill was better yeah. all right. So, yeah, that, that. I, I was I was I was surprised they were able to interpret like Sans's moves head into like a three D five or well a three D space, but it was a two D three D. You know what I mean? Not an actual three D. Yeah, we know what you like mean. in a three D. I'm sure everybody knows what you yeah. mean because it's been a two D staple in so many fights for ages now. Yeah. But yeah, it, it, they did a pretty good job. I mean, I'm not like a super big fan of both characters, but I'm not super big fan of the animation. It, but it's still not awful. Like it's nothing to yeah. it's nothing to complain about. Uh, it, it's fluid. They, it was creative, at least. It's like my yeah. fluid. Haha. Uh, <laughs> anyway. Speaking of fluids, sand. Fuck off. <laughs> that was awful. I hate sand. I it's hate it. Of course, and it gets everywhere. <laughs> Sand farmers. Okay, so uh, Gara versus Crocodile. Better than moisture farmers, am I right? You know, this, 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 this Gara and Crocodile shit makes me snappy, yo. <laughs> that was terrible. It was. It was awful. For his main hope. Uh, so uh, this fight happened. It was kind of bleh. It yeah. was pretty bleh. I yeah. like it because I'm a One Piece nerd, and I liked all the little nods and move for Crocodile, yeah. and because also he won. But yeah, I didn't, I, which I did not expect casual. at all. Apparently the plan was Gara, and they changed it. He thought, no one will expect this. You know, fuck the fact that, you know, this One Piece really needs to eat more L's. You know? <laughs> 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 oh no, they're de they're definitely eating an L next time. Who are they facing? scared if it's somebody I like. Uh, maybe, you never know. What is it? We said Sanji is the only one who lost, and that kind of hurts me because I love Sanji so much. But yeah, yeah but and yeah, yeah. Luffy, Zoro, Ace, and Crocodile all won. I think I'm missing. Some. And Luffy. Luffy. I said Luffy. I said Luffy. You must just call it. I thought you said it. Yeah. Uh, and also, he's One Piece characters just tend to win like everywhere else. Death Battle is the only place that I can think of that they've picked up a loss. Um, when they picked up the loss with uh, what's it called? You know, Ace. Ace. Not soon. Not yes. soon. You know that really good fight, that fight that we all love here. <laughs> Everybody here loves it, especially Matt. <laughs> especially oh, yeah. you. You wa watching. I never forgot about you. But he's talking to you guys again. Uh, right, so th <laughs> this fight happened, uh, again, and so. I think we can stop talking about it, and that'll make me happy. Uh, so. Uh, uh, so here's the fight that we've never seen. Virgil versus Sephiroth for like the third time on this podcast. Third! And it's the second time we're talking about it in this Why episode is this alone. Third time. Yeah, yeah Bell, um, shit on this. I don't even understand. <laughs> uh, yeah. Why? What is it? Why are we still here? They plunged their swords into each other. Yeah, this was a good fight. I liked it a lot, actually. It was, yeah. It was okay. Yeah, cutting the meteors yeah. was pretty cool. They did the devil yeah, again. Good. They did more with it this time. Uh, last time I was really surprised Virgil it be won. That, last time I was really surprised Virgil won, and then Sephiroth, like, the draw with the rematch. And then for Sephiroth to win the death battle, it's kind of like, oh, there's how the story arc ends. <laughs> 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 um, which, honestly, they cover fucking everything between all three fights. So it's like, yeah. Oh my god, you're right. So it is a complete story arc. Still need to turn into a frog. <laughs> Except, no. Virgil gained weight from, like, depression of the tie. <laughs> <laughs> he had to. He had to fuck everything. He lost. <laughs> That's why he didn't see it. <laughs> this is oh, this party is no There we go. This is the official head can. You can watch the three part saga of uh, Sephiroth versus Virgil right here in this playlist. I'm not gonna make. Uh, so uh, yeah. All right. Oh. Vegeta. Vegeta and Thor. It was bad. Thor. It was yeah. super bad. It was an no, offense. Yeah, let's, let's, let's give it credit. It was an audition that they made into a into a full episode without notice. You know, it was just Fair they, they put it's something they put out to put something out because they didn't have anything ready. But yeah, at the same time, it was it's bad. an audition that they threw out yeah. at short notice. Yeah, at the same time, it's like what Get the out. fuck, dude? Don't you For care about your uh, don't you care about yourselves a little bit more there? Like oh, <laughs> they have they have an obligation. They have to do it. But at the same time, 
Does not mean we're not going to criticize the product? Um, nope. nope. And it, the product was pretty, most, pretty fucking boring. The fight Which was just he never straight. loses. Yeah, Vegeta never can lose. It's a rule. And he's only going to get upgraded in about Wait, uh, three hours. My time. Uh, three hours my time is when uh, the next episode of Super airs, and he's probably going to get upgraded in that. So, you know, he's going to be doing even less losing because people are going to are going to like want to see that form doing cool shit. Uh, and like, okay, and we say it like this, but is it really a problem? No, well, he beat Tor this time. I have a problem with this one. But also, I don't yeah, because it's of Vegeta. Thor, Thor's cool. Like, no, I'm saying, like, in gen just general, Vegeta getting wins. Thor is, like, really starting to get shit on, and I don't like it. But at the same... Well, DBC in yeah. general has just been getting wins. Yeah, DBC needs to... DBX, what man they lay. They just don't lose unless it's Goku to Superman. And off, who else? Boo lost to yeah, Kirby. I mean, that's, like, the only one. That's, that's the true. only one. Boo lost to Kirby. But that's because of Nintendo Wink. Yeah. And the Kirby <laughs> factor, as yeah. we call it. Yeah. Yeah. So... But, uh, factor. <laughs> yeah, so uh, although I'm fine with Vegeta taking a W, DBZ really needs to eat an L sometime, and I think eventually actually Piccolo it, versus Martian Manhunter. Yeah, that's probably going to be. Wait, oh yeah, the lost... Piccolo lost that too, and I think I'm pretty sure when Depa will do it, he's going to lose that too, and they're going to do it. So uh, yeah, does 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 Piccolo legit lose though? Yeah, he, or does he, he gets, has he got? He gets nothing from Super. Yeah, probably. The, on, the only thing he gets in Super maybe is like skating to Frost, and that that's worth nothing because Frost. Yeah, he just he get nothing. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He also did stuff against the yeah, Super yeah. Namekians that gave Gohan trouble, and Gohan's like blue tier, but Gohan's also did like yeah, all the heavy lifting in that fight. So no, he gets nothing. Um. So yeah, it's still accurate. He's definitely he's definitely gotten stronger in Super, especially after he started training with Gohan again. Medgay's Boy. so fucking antsy because he knows what we're going to talk about next. Uh, okay, so Alucard versus the <laughs> Heat. Uh... <laughs> 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 right. Uh... Uh, yeah, that was really good. Alucard, Dimitri. <laughs> that's uh, that one. <laughs> okay, let's go. Uh, last woman melee because uh, beautiful Joe versus Scott Pilgrim. If, if, yeah, if Frieza versus Mewtwo has come out by the time this episode comes out, sorry, it wasn't out when we did it. Uh, right, right. But Met. everyone else says it's okay. I think it was, in my it biased opinion, average. it was great. Yeah, and yeah, Met. it was just like yeah, yeah. Beautiful Joe could have actually no. I think Beautiful Joe used enough of his Ross of his moveset because. Like, even as a guy who hasn't played his games, he has a lot of stuff to cover. He died again. Uh, it, he's back again. It's no, I heard him. Scott has fists. They should have used the sword, but at the same time, there's the sword and it's still one. Joe might have been dead, and I honestly wouldn't have wanted that. It was average. The same. Man, it, was, it was sick. The woman. It, uh, the, the choreography of the, the animation was really good. The, the uh, beautiful Joe DBX was better, just saying. No. <laughs> it was. No. It helps that he I had a even, better I, I, Like, I would have been fine with him losing. The it's woman just, melee. I, I, enjoyed the, the I enjoyed the lead up. I enjoyed the. They should have switched the uppercut finishers. Like, the one. Take the one from, like, the combo in the middle of it with, like, the headbutt and, like, the hype close ups, which were really good. By the way, close-ups, matching the art style. Mm -hmm. Use that at the end, like with the got power geyser thing. That should be the finisher. And yeah, I feel that, that's, people would probably be. That's really the thing that I had the biggest problem with was that finisher, and yeah, that might have helped things a bit. Like at, when I first saw it, I was like, I liked it because oh hey, at one don't know who's going to win. At the like last few seconds, like I thought, I thought Joe had it in the bag. Yeah. Wait, anyway, was, uh, was fine. Scott, Scott lost even though he won. <laughs> anyway, Alucard versus Dimitri, let's go. Yeah, now we're yeah. Oh, let's fucking Boy. go. This is probably the best of the these animations that we're going to be talking about. It was good. It is the best fucking DBX ever made. It, if you have, disagree, yeah. you can fucking fight me. It's up there. It's definitely <laughs> yeah, no, top I'm three. Not just uh, I think I like fucking Cloud vs. Guts more myself. But on it, fight me. I fucking will, bro. I'll bring my shillelagh yeah, and my hurl. Alright, we're doing live, <laughs> live action. Death. We're doing live action fights next podcast. We'll talk about the next podcast, too. We're going to analyze 
<laughs> how the fucking Ben and Chad screwed us over in scaling. But, <laughs> but yeah, Out versus Dimitri, it was it, it was fucking cinematic. It had uh, awesome animation. It was hype. Fucking Dimitri was a badass. They they showed a lot of Alucard. Not everything because you fucking can't. So uh, Symphony of Night is retarded with what they give him. <laughs> and the animation, uh, or no. So yeah, I say it's the my favorite. Uh, zero ten didn't use Midnight Bliss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I tried. Am I wrong? I'm not wrong. Okay, moving on. You are not wrong. Uh, I think I don't think there's much to say about Arden. It's fucking excellent. You should watch it if you haven't yeah. watched it already. Yeah. Uh, right. Watch it. And get hype for Castlevania. Whenever that's a thing. Get, hi uh, get hype. Why? Get hype. For fucking six no. episodes. You're gonna. Blue balls us, God. <laughs> yeah, it, there'll, there'll be a second season. No, what you really should get hyped for is Dark Stalkers Four when that happens. Uh, what? The silence was but, perfect. Yeah, yeah. yeah uh, no, I know, but you didn't hear you what you said. Oh, that that doesn't matter because I'm the only one who matters because I'm recording. I said Dark Stalkers Four when that happens. Get hyped oh. for that. Oh, hey. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> I feel pain <laughs> every day. Um. So next up Good. is uh. A fight that should... Okay, these next two fights have something in common. They're fights that, in theory, should be a slam dunk. And in practice, were underwhelming at best and got off. We're not. Um, we're not a slam dunk. So, first of all, we have Noctis from Final Fantasy XV and uh, Two Booty. Yeah, no. <laughs> Here. Automata, whatever. Yeah. True. From, True. from all that porn you've seen around the place. <laughs> From the porn I'm looking up right now, I mean, what? <laughs> Anyways, uh... Follow that to these on Twitter. Fine-ish. No, it, this is yeah, the... Why did they use Maple Story Sprite? Yeah... <laughs> it was basically yeah. Maple Story. Like, what? Yeah. Yeah, mm. is right. It, 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 mm. it was... They're all chibi and weird. Yeah. Short. World of Final Fantasy. Not have weight. There was very little speed. Uh, sounds all Unless over you, the place. I've heard that it's actually. Yeah, what was I talking about? Speed it up. I have like, watched the speed it up. Player. Yeah, I have watched speed it up, and it's a lot better. It's a lot better speed. Up. Even the sounds are like at the right pitch. Huh. <laughs> so they're like two of a pitch then. Yeah. It's, it's hard to explain. Uh, you said that like a joke. Okay, it's, it's better. It's better, it's better. Uh, on the other hand... Now let's go get... Oh, fuck me. No. There we go. On the other hand, uh, something that isn't as salvageable sped up is uh, Kratos versus Dante. Ooh. Oh, God. Again, ah. this this fight should, if, if possible, there have been more of a slam dunk in terms of choreography. Like, so there should be much. gods here. Yeah. Literal gods here. But instead, um... We get one of the worst ones in DBA. Yeah, it's... it's, it's uh, we're, we're right, yeah. definitely we're right back at definitely season one. Definitely history. We're right back at season one with this one. Yeah. yeah so, uh, it was really bad. Um, when we all felt the pain of a thousand... Issue one that they just threw in there, wasn't it? Hmm? Kind of God, similar stop to... Doing that. Vegeta versus Thor. Yes, this is very similar in that... Yeah. Guys, guys, stop doing that. Um, I'm talking uh -huh. to you through attack. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, so this fight exists, and we kind of wish it didn't, because I'd like to see this as a proper... I would have liked to see this as a proper death battle. I don't think that, that can happen now. If it can, please do, yeah. because if no other reason... It's a meta rivalry, mostly, um, which kind of yeah. sucks. But also, it's fight animation would be just as god tier as Dante vs. Bayonetta if done right. And, uh, what's it called? Uh, Kratos deserves better than what Spawn gave him, even if he loses to Dante. So, yeah. Um, yeah. next one. But yeah, they didn't, yeah, they didn't use anything, like, it was poorly paced. And then, versus Beautiful Joe. Yeah. Yeah. Captain Falcon vs. Beautiful Joe, uh, double KO. Uh, it was really good. I like this one. Yeah, it was, it was, it was pretty, like... It's funny what beautiful Joe could do when you put him a good felt, opponent. Like it had, it had a lot of energy to it. I liked it a lot. Yeah, uh, the, the finisher yeah. was really cool. They both did. They both were kind of gave things to each other in equal measure. Everything was kind of hype. Everything was overblown. 
Uh, the, set, the, setup, the setup made sense. Uh, Joe was fighting someone cool this time. You know. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna keep. I made that joke like five times. I'm gonna keep making it until we stop. Yeah, it was a good fight. Um, are we good? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Pretty much. Goku Black versus right, well, Black Adam. Adam. It was actually a lot better than I thought it was gonna be. It was pretty. It was. It wasn't the best, but. That's pretty good. Yeah, I, I would have liked if Goku Black had done more Blade and the uh, sight shit instead of just generic DBZ beams, but it was still really good and the choreography was okay. You know, can't complain. I, I really like the tackle from like Orbit. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, the fucking kill by going through the Kamehameha with the sword, with the beam, with the blade. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah. I still would have liked if they the like way. if they take like. And, and it's just not like generic energy beams and punches and stuff like Thor and Black Am kind of both fall into that kind of fall into that same problem where they don't show versatility but at the same time it's like Black Adam it's it's not as bad as Thor just because there's not a whole lot to go with but I don't know yeah I agree because I would have liked to seen a little bit more from him yeah Black Adam doesn't have that much more though not like Thor who has no uh loads well, um, Zod kind of had that same problem too, where it was just like heat, uh, heat vision, and then punch. Well, yeah, the rest is Arsenal Superman. There's not, not much more. Really. He could have used guns, I suppose. Like, okay, sneeze, bro. Like, everyone keeps saying, like, you all keep saying, like, how like down points of the fights are. They don't use a lot. They don't have a lot to use. And, like, I get it, but at the same time, if the choreography is good, does it really matter? Yeah, but the thing is, this would have made the choreography better a lot of the time, is what we say. And a lot of Probably. times when we complain about these fights not using XYZ, it, it, it is fights with a bad choreography, you know? So They could be, they could be pretty, I, I but they could... I just wanted to, like, get that out, get that out yeah, there. I get, yeah, I get. it's a I good mean, point to just... make. If the fight's still entertaining, it's like, oh, why didn't like they the, Yeah, like, totally, the fight... Play? Yeah. What I mean is that, like, the fights could be pretty and stuff, but it could be just not, like, a whole lot of substance to it. Like, yeah. you know, it's like, you, you wish more, I don't know, just more, mm -hmm. yeah, in a way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I think we're doing this one, so, last EVX. Holy shit, we got through this shit all fast. Already I've, an hour I've already more. forgotten about it, uh, honestly. Yeah, Gambit <laughs> versus Taskmaster. It wasn't bad. Well, as far as Gambit died. It was, for, yeah, was it Gambit, though? It was fake Gambit. It was alternate costume. It, it was uh, gamble. <laughs> gamble. <laughs> I like that. It was. It was. Uh, think of someone else with a card playing motif. It was the Joker. Fuck. Uh, so yeah. Mine was better. Yeah, it was. It was X Men Origins Gambit. Yeah, let's go with that one. Hey. Um, as for actual fight, Gambit probably win. Gambit. Why was Blam it Marvel versus it. Marvel? Like. It, I don't know. It was. Both of it's them, super you can weird. so much more of both of them. Even in DBX, assuming you're saving Taskmaster as Kakashi. Like, wait, was ScrewTech like, okay, guys, guys, we get it. You don't want Marvel vs. DC anymore. We got, we get it. We got you, man. We got you, fam. Here's some Marvel vs. Marvel. <laughs> now go on. Two go of into the, the Marvel fields, for you. some hay. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, guys, guys. It's X-Men vs. Marvel. Oh, it's... yes, this is true. Oh, uh, you, you know what, Tommy, yeah, right. Tommy, Tommy, you you should, me not Marvel. Tommy, you should work for, you should work for Marvel, because you can market shit like that. You got a future, kid, <laughs> a future. Uh, so, uh, kill all of them. <laughs> yeah, this fight happened. It was pretty solid, like, animation-wise, but it's like, who cares? It's Gambit and Taskmaster. It's like, Taskmaster exists in versus shows to be Kakashi fodder. And Gambit exists to seem to be everyone fodder. Like if you don't have a fight, throw them against Gambit. They'll win. Uh, that's not. <laughs> in all fairness, Gambit has not like ever appeared in a research. Who would Gambit fight in a research fight? Sorka maybe. Mm -hmm. From a uh, Hunter X Hunter. Yeah. Sorka. I don't know. The <laughs> depends if you use full eh, bullshit Gambit or just what he can actually do. You know, there's two different approaches to him. Um. So yeah, I think that's it for DBS. Oh, yeah. Wasn't that awful? Like, All right. I'd say about uh, only two, two good, one average, and or three good, one average, and two bad. No, not a bad haul. <coughs> yeah. So, uh, about on power. One so more. the season five, season four was a thing. Yeah, it's done. Now, now it's season five. Season five. Where, yes, who's back? 
back again. Black back Batman again. versus Black Panther. <laughs> you know, no more I... Batman. Uh, we're gonna get the whole Batman. No more, more Batman. More Marvel's DC. There goes like the whole thing I uh, that they had going with each new season premiere introduce a new franchise. Yeah, yeah cool there's no returning franchises in like any season premiere from what I can think of. Yeah, there wasn't. But now it's dead. Now it's just Marvel vs. DC again. And now, and now Batman! We, now, now the... It's been tainted. Yeah, not only that, uh... <laughs> it's Batman again! Yeah, like, you know what's worse? You know what's worse? You know what's worse? They didn't have that much problem with it. You know what's worse? Two things that are worse. One, is this is definitely not the last Batman fight we're gonna get. Because we had still got... Yes, we, we got Nightwing, we got Red Hood... And we got Black Cat all like with pretty Stupid much. Robin Battle Royale. Or not Black Cat, Catwoman, that all have pretty much locked in fights. Uh, that's not to mention the new people like. I really <laughs> don't want to see Catwoman versus Black It's gonna happen, so shut bad. up. Yeah. It's so eh. It is so eh, because it's literally just so one eh. of them is, has a superpower and one doesn't, therefore the other wins. But like, yeah. it's, it is eh, I agree. But you know, and it gets views. But Catwoman, uh, if even if it's not Black Cat, and it's gonna be Black Cat, Catwoman's probably gonna get a fight anyway because she gets views, as as Med said. Uh, well, Red, and, Red, like, yeah, the maybe, more I see that argument, like, the more honestly, I hate it. I wouldn't be surprised. That's if, the only other I wouldn't be surprised if Red Hood versus Winter Soldier ends up being 3D because it's that requested at this point. I, every time I look down in the comments, it's section, just so. Okay. It's just a black. I look, like, I look down on. the comment section. There's like so many comments of that. Every single comment this has it at this point. It's probably it does. It's probably the it's most requested fight right now. Blah. It is blah. I agree. Blah. And then we have Nightwing versus Daredevil, which is also pretty much guaranteed to happen unless Daredevil against like, Kenshi, uh, which is also blah. Which that, I don't know which is blah. that. That's more blah. Listen, okay, Honestly, I'm, I I'm prefer Nightwing. I'm gonna get my soapbox here. I gotta get out my soapbox here. Like to to the few hundred people that this reached out to the fucking minuscule percentage <laughs> like come on like suggest something that actually has superpowers and it would be cool to watch like not only of these like fucking street fighter guys or street level guys <laughs> really, we had enough of them but you at know at least the street level is with like, superpowers instead of bat, bat fucking family people we had enough fucking gadgets and shit like <sighs> no have them like cool gadgets bunch of fucking overhyped ninjas no, like fairness, come on at man. least black panther might lend himself to a cool animation and it's bio animating it and he's wanted to do a dip out for ages so he's gonna give his all and like and i shouldn't be mad that he's in black panther yeah he may like okay and i know batman's a better black character movie. most of the time infinitely yeah no, infinitely. Just... even that batman's worse <laughs> the only time i hate batman more is when he goes full batwank like in the current you know batman's versus the multiverse story Awesome. Batman is perfectly fine when he's in his. I mean, times where he gets bad but, when like, he's in crossovers. Even when he's I'm in, just in a Black Panther. Even when he's in a crossovers and he's just playing the role that so, you'd expect someone of his stature, if it wasn't Batman to play, then it's fine because he still often does something. Like you, you know, but yeah. when he's taking. It's when he's like getting like uh, when he's like showing up. Leaguers, and he's just so much better than everybody. It's where it's like, the, the, as much as I love yeah. it, like the Justice League animated show, like did that a lot. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's some characters got like their own focus episode, but a lot of time was just look at Batman. Remember, he had a cool show, and that's pretty much what started it. Uh, before that, it wasn't a lot of Batwank, but after that, after the Batman no. show, like it still existed, but it wasn't as bad. Everyone got it in fair amounts. Everyone got their own focus story, but now it just seems like every other, every like six months there's a new Batman. Batman saves the Justice League. Yeah. Batman beats all the threats with his big fucking bat dick. Yeah, and then you know what's funny? <laughs> it's the next like story arc will have bat. Batman go down in like one shot to the fucking scarecrow or something. Yeah, and it's just like it's just. Uh, it's next. Anyway, this fight. Uh, black. There's two ways this goes. There's two ways. Yeah. It's either Black Panther rips Batman to shreds with no diff. Uh, or Batman gets a Hellbat and does the opposite, you know. Rips. Yeah, Hellbat right. is just so far removed from it everything. Really it's just is. so. It's it's something that if they're going really to they, could discuss. They, they 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 might if they brought him back three times. There's no stopping them from doing Batman versus Iron Man. Like we all know it deep in our hearts that that is definitely something they're thinking of. <laughs> that you yeah, have to give Hellbat in that case. Yeah, like save it for that. Yeah, save it for that. I agree, and that that'd be cool. Get, get him like his whole fucking arsenal of like. Batmobile. Also, what's funny is that would probably be a fucking copy-paste of Lex versus 
Tony. Except it'd be fucking, it'd be legitimate. Because, you know, swapping armors and surviving would definitely counter the hell that the suit that kills you while you're in it. Like, really, really <laughs> quickly. It's like, he should not be in that suit for a long, like, any extended fight. He has to get in that suit, end the fight, get out of the suit. But he probably wouldn't against Tony. Uh, so, yeah, but against Black Panther, he would if he got it. But without it... Black Panther's standard arsenal counters, it, like, Black, everything. He just has so much shit. He has so much shit. You know, he... If they... The <laughs> suit made of vibranium, which, okay, he I was going... He can command the fucking the dead. He's still the king of the dead. He can command the fucking dead. What the fuck? What the fuck? If, 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 yeah. if Black no, Panther but... versus zombie invasion, suddenly it comes Black Panther and zombie invasion versus you. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Um, Black Panther is basically okay, you. Um, it's just basically Marvel like... looking at. Oh, go ahead. Uh, okay, so before I heard zombies and controlling the dead. Did <laughs> um, uh, I mention he was uh, a fucking man? Fuck off. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, yeah. So vibranium suit. How does that work? How do you make a suit out of a shield and like because it, his it, fucking because Wakanda has dude, all the vibranium. Vibranium. It's so Wakanda's there's stupid. vibranium that he uses vibranium for fucking earmuff, okay? And for like so it doesn't make sound fucking ridiculous. Look, it, it's like if you lived in a gold city. It's exact same thing, except his is a super metal. Um, but like med med like Marvel. Panther only exists because Marvel looked at Batman and it's like, you know what, hold my beer. And they just made, like, the most perfect fucking street-level character ever. Yeah, he, like, he's, holy he's shit. Clocked. He has so much <laughs> shit. Like, he's, he's, a better he's, he's a better fighter than Captain America. Like, he legitimately is. Cap the only time he fought Captain America and, like, they drew... Cap or, no, Cap beat him once. And then they fought a second time and Black Panther beat his ass. And Cap said... He's one of the yeah. best martial artists. He's, he's one of the best he martial artists. He is one of the alive. smartest people. Yes. He has... A well, he's fucking, like, uh, in terms of intelligence... He's, he's, sm he's, he's smart enough to be on the Illuminati without his fucking political clout. His political clout he has pushed him fucking... into the upper echelons of the fucking Illuminati. If you don't know what the has... Illuminati is, go... Just... He has free access, almost unlimited access to one of the most like des highly desirable materials in the entire Marvel universe. It's like only his adamantium is probably society. better, and even that's debatable. His, yeah, his only, his whole society that he's the king of, by the way, is like the most perfect fucking society ever conceived by man. The only, all, the like, only country they, on earth. They are the only civilization they fought on off earth. An invasion from Kang. Yeah, they, don't... they fought off in the. In the in the cartoon, they fought off an invasion from Kang the Conqueror by themselves. The only nation on Earth with comparable power to Wakanda is Atlantis. When those two, <laughs> when those two go to war, then the whole world sits up. Oh, and maybe Latveria, but that's only because Doom is in Latveria. Latveria is a whole kind of yeah. Like shit. It's it's pretty much all Doom. Yeah, it's literally all Doom. Uh, but yeah, it's it's yeah. Wakanda versus Atlantis is basically Atlantis versus the Amazons. That's the equivalent. Yeah, except. Uh, yeah. like wow. in a way yeah, it's, it's, it's actually very that's a very good comparison um as for uh what's it called he has antarctic vibranium you know that's remember that guys so he <laughs> yeah he yeah. melts he literally melts all of batman's equipment since they're all fucking metal he can no sell emps well, he has his own emps he has rebreeders yeah, he can see in the dark and true like and different like this is not by the way his seeing in the dark and seeing in like different spectrums of light that's natural that's not that's not he can just do that uh, well, just... now to be fair like to be fair like some Batman has a large enough arsenal to where some of like the minor stuff like you know like sensors pull each other out but I mean the guy has fucking anti-Batman gloves <laughs> claws yeah. and he is made out of have we, Captain America's have we meant? and his love. Yeah, the only way to counter that... And he can teleport. The only way to counter that suit is if you slash along the grain. There's no way Batman can figure that out because it's a metal he's never seen before. It's this technique he's never seen before. You can't... Like, you cannot bullshit him figuring that out without prep. If he fought... Oh, but I so hope they could. But and even if they do, so fun. his fucking dagger is bypassed literally all of his shit. It's, they, yeah, they've they can face it's pretty much intangible daggers. They, they, like, no cell armor. He's torn. Oh, it's so, he's so bullshit. Black Panther's like. Like, he can, he can 
I'm like, literally only looking for him because of the MCU. Also, he can board the- remember the future Black Panther that came back in time that had like was in a coma and no. all that shit, but he had telepathy. That's the thing that happened. I don't remember this. I, at I, all. I, I was I was going wiki <laughs> walking. I was going wiki walking, and uh, there was this one time where Black Panther came back to the future to prevent his past self from falling to like a horrible fate where he was like he was dying, but he had like high level telepathy. Uh, and then, so Black Panther spends like next while trying to keep his future self alive. So he better be fighting off yeah. like the most bullshit fucking roster. But I don't even know what his fucking roster is. Like, cause he it's all Wakandans. Them all. It's all Wakandans. <laughs> Only a Wakandan can challenge it's all a Wakandan because they're all just as also as him. there's people trying to exploit Wakanda, away. but they also they have like anti vibranium shit. It's exactly like Superman in that his roster is. Explicitly designed his to roster counter his like bullshit, his but in, unlike Superman, yeah, Superman's whole thing is his whole moral shit. You know, uh, like he has to deal with it in such a way to not cause mass destruction or not kill the people he's fighting. Black Panther doesn't give a fuck about any of that. <laughs> <laughs> if he has a way to counter that person, he's gonna counter that person, even if it involves stabbing him in the eye repeatedly and like making me instant. As long as Wakanda gets its justice. He just... Why do people like this guy? Because like, he's, he's so Batman. Popular, because he... but... I'm the hypest person, and like he's, and it's not as bullshit as the comics. Yeah, the MCU what, version is what, okay. The yeah, the MCU version is pretty good right now. He's getting his own focus. He's yeah, getting. He's, only... he's getting focus. Uh, that yeah. was a pretty good. I like Civil War a lot. I do. Uh, I yeah. Mar- you know, yeah. People give Marvel movie shit, and so do I. But like. They made some. That one was. I enjoyed. They that made one. some really good. And recently as well. They like, made good movies. This, this year with uh, Guardians two and Thor Ragnarok, uh, they were really good movies. Also, while yeah, we're talking, there was another uh, one. While, yeah, for, there was another one. Bro. Shut up. <laughs> while, while, while we're on <laughs> that uh, topic of uh, movies, the Last Jedi is the worst movie ever made. So uh, just getting that out there. Uh, so <laughs> just making sure my thoughts are known. I've avoided bringing it up in the Discord. Because anyway, I uh, was, uh, was, we should probably okay. uh, Mark and yeah. get back to. <laughs> I know. I, mean, I, just, I, I was I was looking for so, a place to put that in. Now I have. Uh, so. All right. Anyway, long story short, Black Panther should win. I hope he does it because fuck him. And although, I, and uh, it, it's just yeah, it's, it's like a why <laughs> either way. Yeah, like basically, yeah. You can never win, ever. I don't want ba- <laughs> I don't want Batman to win. Because I'm sick of Batman like more than I am. Fucking Laura versus Drake was a lot more like I was more interested in that because there's more you could do with that. Okay, even though they're just let's guys let's sell let's sell this debate once and for all. The season premiere uh, has been tainted. We got, let's sell this debate once and for all. The real debate: who's like succeeded more in life? Because Batman has banged Catwoman, but Black Panther has banged Storm. This is the real debate. <laughs> On one yeah, hand, I'm Chocolate Black Beauty. Black on the other hand, Selena is Selena. Uh, but uh, if if we count like animated shit, he's probably banged Wendy as well. So I guess he wins. Ah, shit. Don't count that <laughs> shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why not? We're doing composites. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> okay, fine. Batman wins because he banged Wonder Woman. Maybe. No, he didn't. He hasn't. He didn't. No, I know. Yeah, no, he he didn't. Yeah. Okay, but he banged then. Batgirl. Uh, you know. Uh, there, he loses. Oh, no. He loses. We oh, fucking proved he it. He loses because he banged Because he's a... F- that's fuck. He banged Batgirl. He cooked Dick Grayson. That's like his daughter. He, he cooked Dick Grayson while doing it, which is the best part and also the worst part. And then they... they Actually, they, uh, more of a niece. They, then they did it again, the killing joke in the fucking movie, which is a good movie after that ep- that prologue. I respect. Honestly, I'd, I'd debate you on that, to be honest. What? Yeah. I respect the director a lot. I forget his name. His his name escapes me. He did a show. The fucking guy who made who made the Batman show. But dude, get your fucking shipping out of In here. In all fairness, that was the comic, and I don't know if he had any. Uh, st- it was was it Spielberg? Yeah, I don't know. If, or no, no. What? I can't remember. No. Uh, yeah, that was. Oh, it was Spielberg. Yeah. It was literally. He wrote the story. Like that was like the introduction to the. It's yeah, a prequel to Batman Beyond. Was... Did he write the? Uh... I think he did. Uh, the yeah. guy who did the intro, who wrote the intro, was the same guy that did the uh, Watchmen prequels. Uh, did was he... it Paul Dini? Did no, he know it was, I don't think it it was, was the Dini. comics where it was the whole Bruce Wayne, and that that was different. That was a different. That was later. That was later into the story arc, and I don't know if he was involved. 
But even if he wasn't, it's tainted now. That whole universe is tainted. Because it has that Taint. in it. No, no, not taint. Tainted. They're different Bruce things. Tim. Bruce Tim. That's who it was. Bruce Tim. Yeah. It wasn't I had to Steven hook this Spielberg. Because I had to get to the bottom of it. It wasn't Steven Spielberg. He did Animaniacs instead, which is going back. Those are, <laughs> those are comparable shows. Don't look too hard. Um, yeah, so this fight, Black Panther should, like, shit stomp. Like, he shit stomp almost. Not worse than Sprite. I'd, I'd say it. Worse than Spidey. He's, like, a complete counter to everything yeah. Batman is. He does Batman better because he was designed from the ground up to be Batman, but better and also black. Um, <laughs> yeah. And this this was before Marvel's uh, fucking uh, SJW kick. They just did it because they could. Yeah, this would. That's not. Uh, was he? Was he oh yeah, one last thing. Uh, black Panther Party, or was that, thing. was that? After? That was after he changed his name no, to Black uh, Pepper oh, for a while because so, of that. Oh, tell me one last thing. Go ahead. Hey, can I uh, shameless plug real quick? Go crazy. All right. Uh, I I am now part of Rex Research Team, so uh, let me just uh, January 29th, uh, Wolverine vs. Guts is coming out, so uh, check that out. Woo! I contributed fuck all to it. Oh yeah, that yeah. On speaking of yeah, speaking, speaking was of crossover, but the start something new for you. Uh, I'm proud. Speaking of crossover X, actually, uh, the uh. What's DJ's role in that? Is he the leader or is he just the product? Uh, he does stuff. He he does the editing and some other yeah, stuff. Yeah, well, DJ. Yeah, he's the, the showrunner. Yeah. The, anyway, the show, I the showrunner I got head out. He's a uh, built. So I'll layout. just uh, check out Tommy's thing. I gotta go. So uh, I'll see you guys later. Okay. Later. later. Bye. So later. we'll we'll sign out in a minute. Yeah, yeah. Let's just, let's just get head yeah, off. We'll, Why? I'll right. sign out in a bit. Uh, Yes, yeah, so this is uh, thanks. I know if you stick around to the end, just be sure to give thanks to DJ for providing a new layout. Uh, I actually have to vote in the thing. Vote, vote for the in the poll. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. And on, uh, next. Stay bold, point boy. And we'll be back next time. Uh, he left too early. All right. Good. It was a pleasure seeing you here, Tommy. Yep. It was yeah, it's fun being here. All right. Yeah. Uh, Mac left. Mac right. left before I could officially yeah. sign off. Oh, fuck. Uh, that's gonna be fun in editing. All right. Well. Until next time, audience. Bye. Bye.